tu sta Johana in tu je Mateja. In sicer smo tu zato, ker sta eno tako zanimivo zadevo postavili, sred Ljubljane, v enem takim hrupnem koščku v bistvu. Zakaj gre, kakšen projekt je to in kako sploh ideja za Jubox? Torej, ob tej posebni priložnosti, ko Slovenija predseduje Evropski uniji, smo bile povabili na strani mestne občine Ljubljana, da ustvarva zvočno inštalacijo, ki bi komunicirala to idejo Evrope. Zato smo se odločili zbrati glasbo iz vsake evropske države po eno tradicionalno peso in celo izbirko spraviti v Jubox. Obrnile sva se k neprofesionalnim glasbenikom, k neprofesionalnim pevcem, zaradi tega, ker tu tradicionalna glasba je bila ponovatko širjena med ljudmi, ki niso bilo ti glasbe. Kje ste pa dobili vse te glasbenike? Iskali smo jih po vseh možnih virih, od prijateljev, prek interneta, prek forumov, prek ambasad, ljudi, ki živijo tukaj, ljudi, ki živijo drugi, z vseh koncev smo jih nabrali. In ta zadeva bo tukaj postavljena mesečno in mesec sigurno, mogoče še te. Ok, tehnična plati pa Johanina, technical. Was it hard to prepare jukebox in the middle of this place? No, it wasn't that hard actually, and it was also, um, I don't really have anything to say technically actually, because it's just a beautiful, very old box, and what is so nice about this box, I mean, we could have taken any shiny new interface, but we decided at some point we take this box, which is a bit like the music that is in it, it is, has its own history, it's not perfect, it is a bit... I wouldn't want to say rotten, but it has like its very own character and its very own sound. Was it and hard to get the jukebox in because there's not a lot of jukeboxes? What? It was very. It started becoming very interesting once we started finding, searching a jukebox that we got into the idea of what kind of jukeboxes are around, and then to find one that we can get here in Slovenia or here to Slovenia, and that would fit our budget. Okay. <laughs> Uh, can we test Jubox now? We can, let's go ahead. Can you the take jukebox. me to Jubox ju ju and show me how it works? I have already shown a few photos. Evo, to je ena fotka fr French. French. Yes. Do you know all these people which sang? Did you meet them? Uh, we didn't uh, meet all of them. Well, we didn't meet them all, but we have with all of the singers personal contact. I mean, we found them personally and all through friends, but paired with everybody at least one or two emails going back and forth or phone calls. Uh -huh. Oh, they were even here in Slovenia and we recorded. Actually, we recorded lots of people here also. Matea, Slovenci kašni tudi. Slovenci je en predstavnik, se pravi, da vsak podžavo ena pesem in tudi Slovenija je Evropski uni, zato so slovenska pesem v džuboksu. Ok, a gremo probati. Zdaj smo glih pri slovenski, ne, čeprav slišim. Ko? Ja. Zdaj glih slovenska pesem. A je to, vse to, ta džuboks v bistvu ne rabi nobenih žetonov za anga? Ne rabi žetonov, je. Zdaj malo gužjo vidim, vse v bistvu lahko tudi malo pokomentirala, kako se to nekaj. Zprav tukaj imamo kodo za vsako državo, zberamo, katera nas zanima in potem pritisnemo kodo na džuboksu in ko če zdaj še ena pesem igra, potem ko se bo ta nehala, bo naslednja, ki smo jo izbrali, začela odigrati. Čemo zdaj eno zbrati? A že brati ove? Portugalska. Zbrati C, ki smo pa posnela zravo. C? Štiri. 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 Štiri.